Welcome back to the Valley of the Jaguar. Uh, Jaguar. <laughs> Sorry about that. Unintentional British accent. I don't know why. But anyway, where we left off, we picked up the first of the two gold Jaguars, and we must now head back outside and place it on a pedestal. And I'm not going to go in the water because there are some fish down there. And as we head back out here, we're going to be fighting some clears. I can't see shit, game! Double your mouse one! Wait, this isn't TF2. Alright, up oh, more clear there. Say hello to my minigun! Yeah. But I got very little ammo for this thing, so it's all gonna go down the way very quickly. And just like that, no more minigun. Wow, half my armor nearly went. But thankfully there's armor right here. Ah, uh, God, my arm is still sore from bowling last night. Yeah, last night I bowled one of my, uh, one of my highest scores. I bowled like a 177, I think. Yeah. Oh, crap. Ah. Tried to get him in midair, but I missed. I'll try this one. Yeah. Ole, motherfucker. Oh. I've got the herpes. Oh, wow. You survived that? Wow. God, my aim sucks. Oh, don't you dare, bitch, slap me. Alright. Reload my pistol. That was already reloaded. Oh. You know, this door is literally out to get me. I mean, seriously. I've never had another door try to, uh, crush me or kill me like this door. And it happened to me before when I'd done Let's Play Serious Sam the Second Encounter with Psycho Fear. Yeah, when we were clearing out that room with the harpies and the werebulls, by the time we finished, I had two health left. And just as soon as I said that, just as, as I said that I survived the whole room with only two health, the door closed on my ass and killed me. <laughs> Not even joking. Oh, man. It was, without a doubt, the most embarrassing moment of the Let's Player for me. But, um, trust me. Psychovir had his moment as well. I'll tell you about that later. But, what do we have here? We got a brand new enemy. This is a Finian Reptiloid Demon. And he shoots out these giant orange fireballs. They travel very fast. And sometimes if they go past you, they'll uh, immediately come right back at you from behind. Uh, yeah, just like that. I just got hit from, the, from behind. However, unlike the regular reptiloid projectiles, um, you can only shoot down their projectiles with explosives, like rockets or grenades or cannonballs. Bullets won't be enough to uh, take them down because they're much... Uh, stronger. But, let's head on over here to this corner for the next secret of this level. Let's go ahead and pick up the armor. And watch out for the giant boulder! Ooh, my god, that was close. Da 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 <laughs> Man, that boulder is like way bigger than the one in uh, Raiders of the Lost Ark. And it's still going. I bet it's going to hit that pyramid there. Will it hit the pyramid? 
No, doesn't look like it. Oh! Uh, hello. I honestly didn't expect these clears to spawn in. I thought they would only spawn in when I, uh, went down the stairs from the... Okay, there goes the clear... And the zigzag... Okay, I shouldn't be doing this. I thought the clears would spawn after I went down the stairs, uh, from the, uh, first temple. But nope, they knew where I was. <sighs> what else can I talk about here? I honestly have no idea what to talk about. I mean, um... Uh, baseball season's over. Giants won the World Series. And, uh... There we got the first Jaguar on the pedestal. Now we gotta find the other... Jaguar. And put it on this pedestal. Uh, the army... Uh, armor? Yeah, army, yeah. Armor around here, and there is. I just picked up some armor. And now let's make our way to the second temple. And what do we have over here? Crowleywood. Hmm. That's worth checking out later on. But right now, let's head over to the second temple and get that second... Uh, b blah blah. Yeah. Get that second gold... Jaguar. Oh no. Ah, God, that hurts. Am I hearing wearables? Yep. Yes, I am. Flamethrower, help me! These guys are just gonna come at me, then they are gonna get roasted. Wow, that like a rare breed of werebull? Wait, did I not take any damage from that werebull? Okay, I got knocked in the air, but my screen didn't turn red. I don't think I took any damage from that. Or maybe I did. I wasn't paying attention to my, uh, to my health. Only one bullet left for my sniper rifle. What the fuck? Uh, I got an idea. That sounds like a reptiloid. Boy, I know my Serious Sam enemies very well, don't I? Ow. Oh! And one of the Zumbles had to come over here and chase after me. Come on. There we go. Watch out for the missiles. Okay, they're not chasing after me anymore. Ah, oh, for God's sake. That was a bit too close for comfort. Huh. Some weird wooden bridge. Ow, oh, shut up, will ya? They never learn. Of course they don't. No head, no brains. Alright, what's beyond this door? Ooh, a room with spikes on the wall. Yeah, not, nice try. And this is 
one of the trickiest parts of the game. Basically, you have to make it across this room without getting impaled. It may seem simple, but here's the gimmick of this room. It's really windy, and basically, you gotta... That was close. Yeah, you have to carefully look toward the door as you're being pushed along the side, and keep holding forward. If you hold the strafe left or right key, you're gonna uh, get pushed even farther toward the spike, and soon you'll die. Alright, next secret, there's a bounce pad right here. Walk over it. And... We got some stuff up here. Oh, goody, more sniper ammo. And what do we have here? Really dark room, and... A light traveling along the floor. Hmm. Maybe I should follow that light. We'll have to wait for it to come back, though. Because I have a feeling something bad will happen if I step out into the darkness. Maybe I should follow that light. I said that just a moment ago, Sam. Oops. Sorry, did I wake you? Apparently I did. Oh wow, he still managed to get me. Uh, what to do, what to do. Ow. There we go. Oh! I hear some kamikazes. But here is the second gold jaguar. And there is another Fiendian reptiloid demon back at the pyramid. And now the whole room's lit up. Which means... Ah, shut the hell up! Alright, you wanna come at me? Come at me! What the hell? <laughs> How did that clear jump so high? That was weird. Still some kamikazes here. Uh, fire grenade. That didn't work. Come on. Alright, fuck this. <laughs> Alright. Now for the other side. <laughs> Ooh, where are these things? I like the face. Reminds me of Psycho Fear. I see you. Alright, I guess that's all of them. I wonder, where was the light coming from, anyway? The one that, uh, we had to follow. Eh, let's not worry about it. Let's just worry about... making our way across here again. Without getting impaled. There we go. I should point out, in the HD version, there is a secret in which you have to destroy all of these... Jaguar statues. And there's a teleporter that will appear in this room that will take you to the other side of the room with the spikes. But not here in the classic version, there isn't. Oh. Hi, Reptiloid. I want to save my snapper ammo. There we go. Oh, and there's some snapper ammo right here. Ow. Oh, wait, is there another... Oh, yeah, there is. Way over there. Incoming. Alrighty. Grab this just for the heck of it. Just for the sake of having full health. Alright, now let's go check out this area with the Crawlywood sign. See what over here. Oh, yeah, I actually we do know what's over here. It's another secret. Secret Crawlywood Movie Studio has been discovered. 
I wonder what they were making over here. Maybe a Serious Sam movie? That would be really awesome to see if there was an actual, uh... Serious Sam movie. Oh, anyway, let's make our way to the pyramid and place the second gold jaguar on that pedestal. But I've got a pretty suspicious feeling. Yep. There are more enemies to kill. Whoa, that was close. <laughs> I was going to say, where'd the missile? Yeah, look how fast the missile comes back after me. Okay, it's gone. Yeah, the Fendian Reptiloid missile travel a lot faster than the regular Reptiloid missile. And upon placing both gold Jaguars on the pedestals, that device activates and destroys the door by reflecting the, the sunlight. Or something like that. I, I don't know. I'm not sure how these, uh, how these weird devices work. And we got more shit to kill. Okay, if you guys are just gonna come after me like you always do, then you're gonna get roasted. Oh, and we have the Marsh Hoppers here. Marsh hoppers aren't that hard to deal with in the second encounter, considering you got the, uh, the flamethrower. And the chainsaw. The chainsaw is great for taking out the marsh hoppers. You can just simply sit in the corner and let the marsh hoppers come after you, and they'll just, uh, get ripped apart. That's a lot easier than in the first encounter, where you didn't have the, uh, the chainsaw. You had only the Tommy gun. Uh, flamethrower back out. I hear a werewolf. Oh! And there are harpies dropping kamikazes again. Mm. Aztec fried chicken. Yum yum. Oh, shouldn't be Aztec fried harpies. And that kamikaze took fall damage. I could tell because uh, he bounced off the ground and uh, I saw blood. But anyway, let's make our way to the central temple. Ah, shut the fuck up, will ya? Screaming banshees? My god. Uh, I'm a little bit scared to peek my head out. Oh, Jesus! Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy! Ugh. Oh, where'd he go? Okay. Uh, serious bomb, do your work! Yeah, I just had to use the serious bomb right there because, um... I was about to die. So yeah, that's what the serious bomb does. When it detonates, it kills every enemy that's in the area. No matter how much health they have, they will instantly die. Well, except for the bosses, of course. Because then the boss battles would be just too easy, wouldn't they? Anyway, here's the next secret. Go through this door. And we got some minigun ammo. Yum, yum, yum. And I just want to look around for some, uh, for some health. I am nearly dead. Up, oh, and we got a harpy and a kamikaze. And there's another one. <laughs> I like how the kamikaze is being flailed around as I'm shooting them. Alright, and now. Okay. 
Now the last secret of this level is over here. It's not really much of a secret. I mean, it's just barely uh just barely qualified as a secret. But now that the central temple is open, we can head inside and get the crystal skull. And finally finish this level. To be, or not to be, that is a serious question. And that was the Valley of the Jaguar. And you'll notice that, uh, that I got 7 out of 8 secrets instead of 8 out of 8 because of that glitched secret uh, that I explained in the last video. But we're all done with that. I will see you guys next time in the next map. Catch you later.